back at it again with the Game of Thrones. Mm. So the last episode came out. Look at that. That restart. Begin, Daenerys. I love you. Okay, that got weird. So yeah, I haven't played this in months, 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 possibly a year. I can't remember. But we're gonna play and finish the last episode. Because fucking YOLO. Let's do this. We'll see how much we actually remember, because I can't remember shit. Fifty seconds into this, and I've swore Sweetie, like three times right. already. No unimportant. It's fine. Be far more entertaining to watch oh, today. this fuckhead. Yes, I remember this. Last house standing. Wait. Motherfucker. You have a good head for business, Lady Mira. What you need more than Oh yeah, she was going around backstabbing. I have to get in there, Sarah. Look, I can't get you in. Marjorie's already furious with you. Marjorie. You owe me for this. Can suck a dick. A You're a wounded soldier trying to prove he's still a man. Oh yeah, this was a spy, yeah. You spied, motherfucker. You son of a bitch, you spy on my house. Oh, hello. Oh yeah, I remember that, yeah. Stabbed by the fountain. Where are you? That's it, fingerprints Tell all over that. Oh yeah, and these guys were wondering about looking for the North Grove. Finn. They're everywhere. We make for the North Grove. Let me save your life and our house. Iron from ice, brother. Iron from ice. Oh, yeah. I think I remember that bit. Got a tuffle. Can you see anything? Is it the North Road? I don't know yet. Look at oh. the North Grove. It's been a while since I used to control on this sort of game. The Ice Dragon. The Ice Dragon. The Forest of Sigil. Those look like ironwood trees. Hmm. Hear the whirlwoods whisper. I haven't seen any whirlwoods this far north. Well, hmm. Ice Dragon. There gotta be points on the map, surely. That must be it. We're close. I think I found it. You found it. Oh, he's so no. dead. Look at him. We can't afford to waste any more time. Uh, Not with the condition he's in. We've made you just it this have far. To trust me. I've gotten you this far, haven't I? Which is nowhere anyone in their right mind would be. God damn, you're optimistic. I, I believe you, Garrett. I hope you're right. He looks like a. How much he looks like go. a druggie. His eyes are fucked. We need to keep moving. <gasps> Come on, Garrett. Oh. Let's go. This room's getting, getting worse. worse. No oh, shit. It burns. it burns like all seven L's combined. Oh. Oh. Listen, Garrett. I know I'm not well. No shit. Up here. Up here that can get you killed. But you've always been there for me. If anything happens, 
I want you to leave me. You take Sylvie and don't look back. Okay. Promise me, Garrett. I need to know you'll do it. If it comes to it, I'll do it. Thank you, Garrett. God, I will remember that. Fuck yeah, well, he asked me to do it. What are you doing? I found Nightshade. Ah, it's yes. Poisonous, but in small doses, it can help with pain. It's rare this far north. Sylvie, we don't have time for this. We need to keep moving. It won't take long. If you just help instead of just standing there. No. Can you help? Okay. God damn it. See? You see this? This is the tree. Ah! Oh, Whatever made this must be enormous. It's a fucking dire wolf, I suspect. Claw marks? Yes, claw marks. Oh, hello, that's a body. God. Damn, son. That torn apart. got wrecked. Let's touch. Still Is it frozen? Must be a fresh kill. That means they're close. Let's get the fuck out of here. Tree of many whispers. That's a bear. Hello. I'm a bear. Yes. Shit. We have to cross the ice. And go into a cave. Hold it off. Go. This makes sense. Fuck you, bear. Can't outmove me. Oh shit, that hurt. Come on! Pull me, Sylvie! Oh, he's gonna get it. Oh, damn it. Oh, I thought the bear was gonna come up behind him then and grab him. Damn it. What kind of bear can't swim? Oh, it's fucking there. You're in a cave. You don't know what's in there. Stupid asses. How is that wound not bleeding e either? Seven house. Seven news. Come on. Well, this is stupid. Is this the North Grave? Oh. You were right, Garrett. Are we here? This has to be the North Grove. Oh, finally. Look it's at amazing. this place. I can hardly believe it's real. Fuck. Whoever they are, they can help us. Hurry! Oh shit, son! Are we there? Or is it a mind fuck? Da -da -da. Hey, I heard you were a wildling. Uh, 
Ah. Hi, Lise. I was sent here. Tell them! I was sent here by House Forester in search of the North Grove. I am wearing a jaw around my neck. <gasps> Probably gonna have to cut this bit out. Jared, tell him what we're doing here. I'm going to grab a can of Coke. Oh, come on, stupid controller lead, work with me. The Ice Dragon. Oh, I got itchy head. Mira Forrester, King's Landing. Andrew Grant, Matt Ulmer, Kent Muddle, Joe Henke, Megan Gritzfield, Sean Manning. Oh, we hear noises. My lady, please, don't touch me there. The altercation. Oh, please, Lady Marjorie. Please don't send me back to Highgard. Finally, you grace us with your presence. I was beginning to think you'd found someone else to serve. My lady, is there something I can help you with? I'll get to you in a moment. Do you realize how precarious my position is with Cersei? Of course, of course, my lady. All the people in King's Landing who steal from the Queen I Regent. I didn't mean... Did you know about this? Know about what? Sarah's been stealing wine. From Cersei, no less. No, my lady. It doesn't sound like something Sarah would do. Is that so? Yes. I had no idea. Really? Half the servants in the keep are talking about it, but somehow you're in the dark? Where's my seal? I haven't seen it in weeks. Do you know where it went, Mira? Do you think that our thief here pocketed it too? Oh dear. Oh, lady, please. I, I would never steal from you. I've yet to meet the thief. I've been holding it for you. Uh, I have the seal, my lady. I was holding on to it for safekeeping. Oh. Well, at least it's found. <sighs> I'm sorry. It's not right to accuse without proof. She took that just, ridiculously well. I need order in my household. Why would she hold on to it for safekeeping? That's stupid. I have no choice. I'd lose my fucking shit. Tommen's garden party, Mira. What were you thinking? I can't believe you'd be so irresponsible. But, uh, Lady Marjorie. I don't know what I you don't mean. Know what you mean? Oh, I must have it wrong. It must have been some other handmaiden making a scene with Lord Andros. Oh, it must have been. Sarah's been saying some damning things about you, Mira. I suspect in an effort to save her own neck. Oh, lady, please. You've said enough. One of you must answer for this. Sarah says you used her to get you into the party. 
Yeah. You've been with me a long time, Mira. When I'm queen, I'll need people I can count on. Shall I backstab Please, Sarah? Tell me this isn't true. Please, Mira. I don't deserve to lose my position for this. Oh. Oh. I'm begging you. <laughs> Just tell her the truth. Sarah, please. I'm my sorry. Lady, I... I'm sorry. Sarah's telling the truth. I'm sorry. This has been building for some time, Mira, but it still breaks my heart. I'm so sorry. I've been nothing but, but I can't I can't be a bitch to I've Sarah. Sarah's done a lot for me. I've even tried to help you and your family where I could. And you repay me with this. I feel betrayed. Well, you shut me out. I won't have it. Forgive me, Lady Marjorie. I promise you it won't happen again. You're right, it won't. Because you're going back. I can no longer have you near me, Mira. Consider yourself dismissed from my service. But, okay. But, but my lady... I said get out. I'm so sorry. But at least you know now. I can't. It's unfair on Sierra. Or Sarah, whatever she's called. I promised her I wouldn't, uh, wouldn't betray her, but fuck, fuck Marjorie, bitch, stupidly hot, oh, here we go. Mira, wait! After what you told Tarwick, I swore I would never talk to you again, but I have to ask, why did you stop Lady Marjorie from sending me home? I expected I'd be on my way to High Garden by now. But I you look out stood for up my for friends. Me. You're my friend, Sarah. I look after the people I care about. Fuck. That hasn't always Fuck been the case. Marjorie. But I appreciate it now. I know you didn't have to. I wish things had turned out differently. But I suppose. Yeah, well, if Marjorie had helped my family out in the first place instead of being a bitch. Sorry, I'm not I told sure with Sarah. I'm sorry I told Tarwick about your name. I confided in you, Mira, and you betrayed me. I doubt I'll ever truly forgive you for that. I just. I was trying to be honest. Yeah. I hope you can understand that. I can't tell, is her eyes blue or green? She's got nice, nice eyes either way. Marjorie, I think it's green. Actually, no, I say blue. To tell you this. There are some vile rumors going on about you. Rumors? About you murdering a Lannister guard. I thought you should know. Thanks, Sarah. Sarah. Careful, Mira. Sarah is not spelled like that. S-A-R-A-H. Stupid game. Let's walk our sexy brunette ass out of here. Who are we on now? It's gonna be the. Uh, okay, are we in Avatar now? They're nearly on us. Half a league or less. Seems you were right. I know that's ah, still the forest guys. He was sent to kill me, not Roderick. He wouldn't run home to his father without trying again. Ah, oh, it's her. Listen close. I want oh, the bitchy surrounded. pants. Ride hard for Ironrack. And don't turn back. If this goes to hell. If this goes to hell. Don't they'll need, need to, to know, know about, about Roderick. Roderick. Yeah. Yeah. Lay low and be ready to strike the moment I give the order. And what order is that, Asher? Follow Just my lead. follow my lead. He didn't pull out a sword then, did he? Oh, it was an axe. Seven hells! Seven news! Take 
she's a badass. She needs to go back to Avatar. We won a small battle. I'm from Avatar. No grit. Oh, he's a bloody coward. Your brother was a coward. coward. You should have seen him squeal. Oh, when Griff gutted him like a pig. <laughs> oh, you fucked. Come on, let me keep punching him. Yeah, keep punching. Yeah. My lord! <sighs> I'm not backing out of that. He gonna pay. Very flat-footed. We're going to kill them all for this. Roderick. I wish I had known him, Asher. I can't think of her name to drink now. With him, fight by his side. Complain about what an ass his little brother is. When I heard he was alive after the twins, I mean, I mean, he rose from the fucking dead. Yeah, the fucking dead. Roderick. Roderick. Kept this house together through, through sheer force of will. My his little brother. brother true lord. His little brother got Wilson's stabbed in the throat, I think. If I remember. But you're the Lord here now, like it or the not. Girl, By the laws of I think is still alive. And to these men, you've more than proven yourself. I know. If I don't become Lord, Roderick's sacrifice, everything we went Beshka. through... Beshka! That's the Lord. one. You'll make Roderick proud. Make your father proud. Yeah, Beshka, and you're going to be my queen. Can see me now. My Lord, forgive me, but Lud Whitehill will be on the move. Let's move! Our blades are sharp. Yeah! Yeah! Asha. I'm your lord now. Bow to me. Mum. Asha. Hello, Mum. No reply back, seriously? Roger. He sacrificed. How could this happen? He sacrificed himself. It makes no sense. His hero he died a hero. Gregor was a hero. Ethan was a hero. Now Roderick? It means nothing to me. It was his sacrifice that enabled us to escape. <laughs> it's not fair. Not fair. Look, he was going to take a oh, long yeah. damn time. Laura, listen to me. We don't dare take time to, to heal his Lord, janky Lord, leg. He could be Whereas Asher night. was, you know, he's fighting fit. But there's hope yet. I've brought help. Warriors from across the narrow sea. There's no equal in Westeros. Whatever their skill, they are hardly an army. My lady, I've seen them in battle twice now. And I've seen Asher lead them. They're a force to be reckoned with. And they'll be more than equal to whatever Lud can muster. How can you say that? We've already lost. What are you talking about? Ramsay Snow. He came here. He set terms of war. He said the last house standing wins. Fuck Ramsay. And with the Lord of House Psychopath. Lady Elena's not wrong. By Ramsay's term. This war's lost the moment the Boltons learn of this. Uh, well, here we go. Fuck Ramsay Snow. Fuck the Boltons. This war is not over until I say it is. 
Asher will lead us. Asher is our Lord. Yeah. This is what the people want to hear, see? Confidence. Asher, I wish this were a happier occasion, but... This sword has been held by a forester lord for centuries. Now, it is yours. Claim. Let's claim this sword. It's my sword now. No longer will oh, I hold. Hail, Asher Forrester, Lord I will avenge you, Lord. Ironrath will rise victorious. My father never trained me to be a lord. This was supposed to be Roderick's oh, sword. It's good coke. But I was trained to Coca-Cola. And by the gods, I will defend my father's house to the last breath. House Forrester will prevail this day. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, us! Woohoo! Oh, why is that popping off? Don't be like that. Sound card. Stay there. No! Stay! What the fuck? Oh, we're back here. He's lying! Look at him. He's a crow. He wasn't sent here by anyone. Never seen a crow this far north of the wall. Must, Must be, be a, a deserter. deserter. No, I have a bit of paper that tells me so. I don't trust fucking deserters. And you're traveling with a wildling. We're not, your, not enemy. your enemy. Says the man who wounded my bear. Who came here uninvited. I could have killed you out there. As easily then as I could now. Are these stuff stupid fuckers I can see so through animals' eyes? I do, so I like Bran's story in uh, Game of Thrones TV series. Shit his character, I fucking hate it. Understand what that's like. But I could make you understand. Enough, Joseph. Just show him the fucking piece of paper, you know. He claims to serve House Forrester. Anyone could say as much. What proof do you have? Bit of paper. If you'd have us believe it's not a lie. I was given this by Talia Forrester before I left. It's the Forrester sigil. Made from ironwood. Oh, come on. Hurry to ease. You trust this crow? That necklace is Forrester Ironwood. No one else could craft it as well. My friend is wounded. He won't live long without our help. Oh, I thought she was going to say your friend is dead. Hi, he doesn't. <laughs> he really doesn't look all Where? that alive. Where are you taking him? Who is this girl? Is she a prisoner? Why else would you be traveling with a wildling? She won't cause any trouble. A wildling girl? She'll betray you the first chance she gets. She better not. I'll put my an arrow in her is head Elsera myself. Snow. <gasps> this is my brother, Joseph. Snow! What is this place? A refuge against the forces of darkness during the long night. Blue candles. A place of great power to those who know how to use it. I assume that's why you're here. You're a long way from home, aren't you? Lord Gregor's last words before he fell were, the North Grove must never be lost. What do you mean? Last words before he fell? Lord Gregor was slain at the Twins months ago, betrayed by Walder Frey. Oh, they're not happy. No. Of course. How could you? He has no idea who we are. Why would he? You're right. He's just a messenger. All he did was use some ironwood necklace they gave him. Why should we trust him with anything? They clearly didn't. Otherwise, he would know. I risked a loss. I risked my life to get here. 
I deserted the Night's Watch, brought my vows, fought wildlings. By the gods, I deserve to know. And we should trust an Oathbreaker. Perhaps Lord Gregor never told anyone. I wouldn't be surprised. Better to hide his shame where no one could find out. Whites. Gregor Wensend and Bjornen. What's going on? This is the gift the Grove gives me. I control these warriors. What about them? Hiftonies. What? No! Let me go! Did they teach you to fight at Castle Black? I hope they did. Otherwise, you're likely to die. I'll do whatever you need me to do. <laughs> Good. Good. Come on, bear. In all fairness, if I saw a fucking bear, I'd want to stab it in the throat with a sword as well. I don't give a fuck whose bear it is. This place is evil, Garrett. I can feel it. There's something wrong with these people. Those warriors. They're not normal free folk. Not like any I've ever seen. They're not. They're controlled by that woman. She already said as much. Ready. Aye. Sylvie needs to learn to shut up. Let's fight these bastards. Oh, we're back at Mira. Lady Mira! Wait! Wait. What is it? Guards, they're searching your room. Break it down. Search the place. <gasps> they're coming after us for the murder. Come on, we can't stay here. Where What's are we going? going on, Tom, Sarah said she'd heard rumors about me. It's all over the keep, my lady. They're saying you take Lannister men to your bed and murder them in their sleep. What? That's ridiculous. It'd be ridiculous, my lady, if soldiers weren't smashing in your door. <laughs> you killed that Lannister. Smashing guard. in her door. There's <laughs> Someone sent the captain of the guard a message about you. Dropped off at the guardhouse. You mean someone's plotting against me? Who? Who sent the message? Marjorie. No seal, my lady. No sign, neither. Whoever's behind this, they're making their move now. If those guards catch you, if they catch us, we've got to stay close to Lady Marjorie. I reckon she's behind it. Or, or, or Sarah. They won't touch us if we're with her. No. She'll protect us. This could hurt her. We can't bring Lady Marjorie into this. What? Why not? Because it could the hurt her. Could hurt her right now. We're not. Scandal. We're not total bitches, okay? They're going to cut off our heads. Well, get used Come to being down. headless. It worked for the horseman. Isn't going to help. Those guards won't stop until they find someone for Damien's death. What are we going to do, Lady Mira? How are we getting out of this one? Don't worry, Tom. We'll figure it out. We'll figure out who's behind this. We've managed to get this far, haven't we? You're right, Lady Mira. But we ain't faced nothing like this. But I don't know how to aid you now. Tell me and I'll... Whoa! Help. Whatever it is, we can't stay here. I need allies, Tom. Allies with real power. If I can get an audience with Cersei, m maybe she'll put a stop to this. Maybe. I don't like it. But I can get her a message if it's what you want. In the meantime, there's a collier store by the river gate. On Muddy Way. Meet me there. Who's there? Shit. Show yourself, or it'll be worse for you. Get to the Colliers. Tell Godwin I sent you. Goodbye, Lady Mira. The coal boy. Take him. Ah! <laughs> 
Jesus Christ. A little smile. Like, uh, I might get a piece of that if I do this for her. You ain't getting nothing on Mira. Oh, who are these? These are the Boltons. Your sister said he was building an army. We can thank Mira, it's not larger. But we'll lose if we go up against that. He doesn't expect us to. He's trying to frighten us into surrender. I want every bolt aimed at Lord Whitehill the moment he appears. Come, Whitehill. There you are. Shoot him straight in the fucking eye. Who the fuck is that? I can't Ryan. remember. Oh, Ryan. Crossbow's up! Asher Forrester! Show your face, boy! Ryan! He's frightened, father. On ya! <laughs> have you come for peace, lad? You're well, a coward. Well, you must for... not have much faith in this army of yours if you feel the need to hide by my little brother. <laughs> You mistake me, Forrester. Ryan is here for your protection. To stop you from being Now, stupid. I feel like we should... Uh, I to want to surrender to get all. Ryan back. You got your little because I feel the mother's gone man. through enough. But it's time so far. You to reason. Where the fuck are you going with that giant penis? I could ram your gates down and kill every last one of you. Or... Or... We could end the bloodshed here and now. Oh, you're such a over, fuck. Asher, it ended the moment Roderick fell. By Ramsay's rules, I'm the victor here. This will all be mine now. One way or another. You put too much stock in Ramsey's terms, Lord. Terms set by a madman. Terms that I never agreed to. You really think Lord Ramsey will ask if you're in favor of his terms before flaying you alive for breaking them? Let's put all hey, it's, it's true. He didn't I'm agree to it. Talk terms of your surrender. Surrender? Open your halls and bend the knee as my bannermen. You continue to produce ironwood. Under my supervision, of course. And you will join your house to mine. Well. For all to see. By wedding my Gwyn. <laughs> well, fuck me. Asha, you can't. It's rather generous terms, actually. That would be easier to believe coming from Gwyn herself. Where is she? Far away from all this, of course. Besides. I speak on her behalf as her father. I will just as happily kill you all and be done with it. But I'm very generously giving you a way to keep your bloody lives. Oh, one last thing. As a show of my goodwill, I brought home the body of your lord. Your brother was too stubborn to know when it was over. Oh dear. Roderick, let me see him. I want to see my brother. <sighs> I'm sure your people will be relieved to keep their lives. I didn't expect this. Yes. Surprisingly honourable gesture, Lord. Of course it was. You have an hour. I'll be waiting in my camp. an arrow in his head right now. Roll the gates out, grab Ryan, pull him back in. Mommy! going to be a trap.
it's going to be fucking Ramsey Snow or something like that, isn't it? Or a bomb. No, they don't have bombs. Oh no, it is. It's Roderick. Yeah, he dead. He dead as fuck. I say bomb. Fucking bomb. I'm sorry, little brother. Jesus. Back then. I've buried too many sons. Maester, take my brother's body. He will join Father and Ethan in the grove. As you say, my lord. But... Forgive me, I, I just... Perhaps the time has come to truly let this bloodshed end. We simply accept. We bow our heads and Asher marries Gwyn. Craven! It's not the worst terms I've ever heard. I may have loved Gwyn once, but this isn't real. My lord will have my head the moment Gwyn produces an heir. There will be no marriage. If we bow our heads now, we'll always be his slaves. We have to kill them, Asher. I piss on surrender. Let's ride out and kill them all. We ride! To war! Feel their blood! Believe me, I want to kill every last fucking one of them. But I'm not sending you all out to certain death. I just don't have the numbers. But, but maybe we don't have to. Maybe. Lord rules that house with an iron fist. His sons, his bannermen, do nothing without his say so. There may be 500 men outside that wall. But without Lord at the lead. They'll scatter like chickens with their heads cut off. Yes. That's Avatar good, woman. How? Lord will not simply cast aside his men and offer his neck. Such a task Let is Lord think he's won. But Lord is wary. Simple. We tell Lord exactly what he wants to hear. We invite him inside to celebrate and drink to our union. And then? Then an ambush. Your pit fighters strike from the shadows. No, an ambush is too chaotic. Things could go badly quickly. Lud could escape. There's another way. Poison. Poison. In his wine. There are those who would call poison a coward's weapon. No. Meister. Lethal. Meister. Shut the fuck up. Either plan is a high risk. We only lure Lud inside if the whole family is there to sell it. Talia and Ryan. We're gonna poison. It's less bloodshed. What's at stake? Ow. My knee just clicked. Poison. Oh. way to see Lord dead. Then we have a plan. Whatever happens to me, I need you to get Ryan out alive. As soon as we move on, Lord. Not a problem. You know you're the only family I've ever had. Oh. That makes Ryan so nice. my brother, too. I won't forget this. I've forgotten the number of times I've heard you say that. I've said that before. Yeah, Beshka, bitch. We will avenge Roderick's death tonight, whatever it takes. Send word to Lord. We'll drink this night to the prosperous future of our united houses. Fuck you! Yeah. Can't remember how long these episodes are. They're like an hour and a half. Can't remember. She's left the keep. Who left the keep? Search the area. Lady Mira. There she is! Take her! What's all this? Please help me. Look more, Gren, please. You have to help me. Mira Forrester, you're coming with us. Please, do something. Surely you have more dangerous criminals to deal with than Lady Marjorie's handmaiden. We have orders from Captain Lucan to- Let me worry about Lucan. You worry about buying yourselves a few tankards. On me. Thank you for keeping our city safe. Oh. Can I take you somewhere, Lady Mira?
The Rivergate. Thank you. The Rivergate. Quick as you can. What's going on, Mira? Is there a problem? Someone's plotting against me. Plotting? What do you mean? They're spreading malicious rumors. A and worse, they've set the guard after me. I see. That is worrying indeed. Clearly you've made powerful enemies here in King's Landing. Although, you've made short work of one of them, at least. I hear Lord Andros has found a home in the Black Cells. I'm impressed. It seems he took on the wrong handmaiden, and lost. Andros was just the beginning. I plan to destroy anyone in my way. Of course, now that you've gotten rid of my biggest competitor, all kinds of opportunities have opened up. Particularly in your part of the Seven Kingdoms, the Ironwood Market is wide open. A lot of gold to be made. And I plan to take full advantage. <laughs> a bold claim for a handmaiden on the run from the guard. You're clever, Mira. Identifying Andros as our common enemy while approaching me as a partner. You showed an understanding of King's Landing that took me years to gain. Of course, I knew you'd be a problem when we first met. Imagine. A handmaiden stealing the crown's ironwood contract from under my nose. That's why I bribed that Lannister guard to kill you. Don't look so surprised. You must have known you'd become a target sooner or later. You... you two-faced shit! Don't you have any honor? Honor? Do you think I got where I am because of honor? We've both seen what happens to honorable men. After Lud takes Ironrust, he and I will control the Ironwood trade entirely. You've been very helpful, Mira. But it's time to get you out of the way. Can't have you complicating things. The White Hills don't understand Ironwood. They can't take care of the forests. You may control the trade, but they'll run it into the ground. Only the foresters really know those woods. You're a fool not to see that. If they leave the hills bare, I'll find another forest. I couldn't care less, and neither should you, because you'll be dead. We've arrived. Now get out of my fucking litter! Lucan, I fancy coming across you here. I seem to have found something you're looking for. That you have, my lord. I've been searching for this murderer a long time. Finally, I've got her. You've got the wrong person. I... I've done nothing wrong. Shut your liar's mouth. It's time you answered for your crimes. Take her to the cells. Chin up, Mera. I'm sure if you ask him nicely, the headsman will be quick. Forgive my brother's temper. It's said over time, wargs adopt the traits of their animal. And your news was... unexpected. You see, Gregor Forrester was our father. And we are his bastards. I doubt anyone knows. It was his dark secret. And he feared his family would find out. That's why you're here, isn't it? I suppose. Josera would say he banished us to hide his shame. But I like to think it's because he knew what we were. That he was protecting us in his own way. We thought one day Gregor would come and see everything we've built. But instead it was you. You are the first to arrive. It must have been a difficult journey. Few try, and fewer still live to tell about it. 
It wasn't easy. I had to break my vows to the Night's Watch. We barely made it. Not many survive this far north of the Wall. But you're here. Our father entrusted us with protecting the North Grove. That has always been our purpose. But we've learned there's a power here, Garrett. A power we've only just begun to understand. Winter is coming, and we haven't much time. Gregor Ven Fionn and Bjorn Sager Ven. Svealog Mopre Bethastan. God, Finn! Did you know him? Maybe I'm wrong. <sighs> he was my friend. His name was Finn. He was here because of me. I let him join when we left Castle Black. That was his choice. It's not your fault. Now his watch has ended. You fought well, for a crow. I saved your life. I wouldn't go that far. Although I admit, you can fight. Maybe they did teach you something at Castle Black. But then, my expectations were low. Is that your way of thanking me? Maybe I was wrong about you. We'll see. 
Killing them I don't mind. It's the burning that stays with you. You'll never forget that stench. Did you see what they just did? They don't care about their own. My sister has trained them well. Emotion is a weakness, according to her. They don't mourn their dead. They've been trained to fight. Nothing else matters but that. The more my sister's doing, not mine. The Whites grow bolder by the day. Ever since the Wild Link tribes went south with Man's Raider. Here, let me help you. I'm fine. It's nothing. I should return to the village. Fulgar and Vysenir. Did you not hear me? Fulgarin, Suna! What? Wait! Fulgar and Vysenir. You're losing control. What was that? It's blood magic. The more she uses it, the weaker she becomes. And they can sense it. Elsa is a fool to keep taking these risks. One day, they'll kill us all if we're not careful. Is there some way to help her? She is convinced her blood magic is the only way to protect the North Grove. That her warriors are the answer. But she can't control it. I worry about her. It's more dangerous than she knows. She was right about one thing, though. The Whites are growing bolder. And the worst is yet to come. Now that my father's dead, there's no reason to stay. That's why he sent you, isn't it? To bring us back to Ironrath. To crush our enemies south of the wall. And avenge his death. No. That's not why I'm here. Lord Gregor told me the North Grove can never be lost. And if he were still alive, he'd tell you Ironrath can never be lost. Family's more important than this. I know what my father said. But he wouldn't want us to die because of it. Where's Sylvie? Never trust a fucking wildling. Jaila, please. Shut it! Please come here. <clears throat> uh, hello? I excuse me? What do you want? Can you get me out of here? Because if not, I don't want to know. Hey, no talking. Jaila, Jaila, come over here. Oh, don't you start again. Why don't you come here for a moment? We can have a little chat about it. God, woman, I said shut it. Or I will come in there, and you won't like what happens. Well, what do you want, then? Well, tell me! Please! I'll do anything. Just tell me! Ugh, bastards! Before the day's over, they'll take us. Straight to the block. So don't give me that look. 
You can leave the judgment to the Father, whatever gods you believe in. I don't judge you. We've all done things we're not proud of. I have a son, a little baby boy. I think of the smell of his skin, his tuft of brown hair. There is nothing I wouldn't do, nothing, just to hold him again. That's what getting out of here means to me. What would you do in my place? I'll never see him again. People will tell your son about you. Stories about what you were in life. Give him a story he can be proud of. But you've no idea what I've done. Doesn't matter what we've done. All that matters now is what we do next. Mira, making friends already, I see. Be quick. We'll be coming back for her next. For your trouble. What? Nothing to say? Block will do that to you. They'll be here for you soon. You don't have much time. What are you doing here, Morgren? Come to rub your triumph in my face. Far from it, Lady Mira. I've come to make you an offer. I was thinking about what you said. And I've come to the conclusion you're right. Blood will likely ruin every forest under his control. Only foresters know how to really work ironwood. That's useful. And then I realized there's something much more valuable than your knowledge of tree, Mira. Your name. I want you as my wife. Your wife? Have you lost your mind? Not at all. This makes a lot of sense for both of us. I want Ironrod. And you're going to give it to me. It may not be the grandest castle in Westeros, but it's a start. Why would I do that? What's in it for me? You keep your head, of course, and I'll get you out of here. But if you don't value that, think of your bloodline, your precious Forester legacy. This is your chance to make sure it carries on. What are you talking about? Two of your brothers are already dead. That idiot Lud will take care of the rest. <laughs> One way or another. And it won't take me long to get rid of the harebrained fool myself. I'm sorry, Mira. None of your family will survive. Ironrath will fall to you. And through marriage, it will become mine. A hold fast in the north. Can only help my ambitions. If all this happens, I want revenge against Lud. Promise me he dies. Let me be clear, Mera. You're in no position to make demands. But it's fitting our betrothal begins in a cell. I'd say it's a perfect symbol for the rest of your life. You plan to keep me locked up? Well, perhaps not literally. If you play your part and produce my heirs. The murder of a Lannister guard can't go unpunished. But I can get you out of here, Mira. One word from me, that coal boy takes your place on the block. Tom! All you have to do is agree to marry me. You'll give up your power. You'll give up your ancestral home. But you'll be alive. So, Mira, 
What do you say? You will never have Iron Wrath, and you will never have me. What? You fool. I'd rather die. Fine. Have it your way. She won't get far. Not out here. Sylvie! It's my brother! I wasn't finished! <laughs> when you're finished here, come see me. There's something I must show you. I don't trust these people, Garrett. Which is why I had to see Cotter. He's not well. And he, he won't live much longer. I thought he was getting help. Whatever they've done, it hasn't worked. There's nothing that will save him now. Which is why I needed to do something for me. I didn't want him to suffer anymore, Garrett. Just to ease his pain, but... That's when they found me. The nightshade. I need you to be the one to end his suffering. But... It's our way, Gareth. You have to feed it to him. I'm trusting you to do this, Gareth. You're the only one who can. I'm sorry, Sylvie. I can't do it. Cutter's my friend. Then you won't let him suffer any longer. You'll see. He's in so much pain. I did everything within my power to help your friend. But I'm afraid it's too late. Nothing can save him now. Sylvie told me. Nightshade? What are you going to do with that? You realize it's deadly. And has no place in here. This is for Cotter. You can't give him that. I don't know what that wildling told you. But that will kill him and taint his blood. <coughs> Gareth, Gareth, is that you? It's me, Cotter. I'm here. Where's Sylvie? I want to see her. Where is she? Don't worry, she's right outside. She sent me to help you. I thought, I thought they took her away. Remember your promise, Garrett. You said you'd leave me behind. To help Sylvie. Oh, I can't bear it anymore. Oh. He's been incredibly brave. A lesser man would have died days ago. But I suppose you already knew that about him. Cotter's a fighter. Always has been. I can see that. But now you can use his death 
to give his life meaning. This was always intended for my father. It's a sacred symbol of the power of the North Grove. Forged from iron, the handle made with ironwood from this very tree. In my father's absence, you speak for House Forrester. It seems only right that you should have this now. You're here for a reason, Garrett. It's no accident they sent you. I'm honored. Thank you. It's well deserved. Your friend is dying. But his life is too valuable to waste. Give me his heart. His beating heart. And his death can have meaning. We can use uh. it for a greater purpose, Garrett. An ancient ritual to help harness the power of the North. I got a funny room. feeling that I've been muted all this, this time. I fear what my so, uh, I don't. Why me? Can't you do it yourself? Not alone. I'm far too weak. You saw what happened after the fight. My warriors, they're pulling away. Please, I need you to do this. Oh, for fuck's sake. And me? For the North Grove. I'm fucking annoyed. I think I've been muted for like 20 minutes now. Right. God damn it. Gary. Can't take it any longer. And his suffering. Use his life to make us strong, Garrett. Well. Give him that poison, and his blood will be useless. Let us use his blood to give us strength. I'll do it. For the North Grove. I knew I could count on you, Garrett. Use the dagger to open his chest. We need his heart. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry, Carl. Good. Now grab his heart. Quickly. While his blood still pulses through it. You're crazy, woman. Now bring it here. Squeeze the blood into the fire. She crazy, son. While it's still warm. Thank you, Garrett. I know it was difficult. Yeah, it was but difficult. You did the right thing. Just ripped the heart out of my fucking mate. Now we must burn. Holy fuck, that's a big. That was a big ass spider, son. Holy shit. Right, well. The wine is ready. Fuck you, spiders. Bastards. When they're all started, <sighs> you give the signal. <sighs> no matter how much they might provoke you, we right. them think they've won. I really hope I haven't been muted for 20 minutes. Fuck, I just hurt my hand doing that. But I had to be quick. Clever. Send the girl first. Don't let her play with your head, little brother. Lady Forrester. My apologies for arriving unannounced. I was hoping I might have a word in private with Asher. Oh dear, this is going to go sour as fuck. My father isn't coming. He's a bitch. I think we can agree these are not ideal circumstances. Agreed. But these are the circumstances we find ourselves in. She's not that bad. She's quite pretty. Family She's good looking. Asher, what your family has suffered, it's unimaginable. Which is why the bloodshed must stop. I agreed to your father's terms, didn't I? You did. But I know you, Asher. 
You're not the one to roll over so easily. You don't like being pushed into a corner. It's not in your nature. It would be a lie if I said otherwise. I appreciate your honesty. I'll need that from you if this is to work. You have to understand. I've risked everything to bring peace between our houses. Oh dear. To meet with Roderick in secret. To tell him of the traitor within these very walls. To make sure no harm came to Ryan as our ward. All while persuading my father the bloodshed would end if we were to wed. I have no ulterior motive. No hidden agenda. Just peace. Once and for all. I trust you, Gwyn. I know you've lost a lot, and... Oh, fuck I'm it. Sorry. I don't care. We're still poisoning this motherfucker. Better. Truth be told, my father's scared of you. Is he? With Roderick, he knew who and what he was dealing with. But you, he thinks you're dangerous. You proved as much when you attacked his men. They came after us. I know. And that's all in the past now, I promise. We can make this work, Asha. This is our one chance. Together, we can control the future of our houses. Just promise me, when my father and brother walk through that door, nothing will happen that could threaten that future. Our future. I need oh, your assurance. Shit. Nothing will happen. <sighs> Fuck. Shit. I knew I could trust you. Sorry to intrude, my lord. But Lady Forrester is in need of your help. Of course. I should go. Well, sorry, Gwyn. Thank you, Asha. You are going to fucking hate me. Oh, then she's done so much for our house. But she could be what backstabbing us. My need? Sorry, my lord. It's all that came to mind. But we have everything in place. How should we proceed? Yep. Ready the poison. Fuck Gwyn. Done, my lord. I'm sorry, Gwyn. I mean, you've done a lot for us, but I can't trust you. She's done a lot for us, to be fair. And I think she's genuine, but fuck, lad. Especially when you push our men around. Elisa, I'm sorry it's come to this. But at least it's done. Where's my son? Right to it, then. Ryan! Mother! Oh, my baby. Oh, my Yay. Baby. <laughs> Enough slobbering. You can have him back when we've hammered out the details of your surrender. Lord Whitehill. Asher, now who'd ever have imagined this? You oh, we're so bad at twos and stuff. To drink your wine and call me father. <laughs> I thought I'd seen the last of you when Gregor shipped you off to the other side of the bloody world. You honour us, Lord Whitehill, with your presence and with this union. Honour you? I didn't take you for an arse licker, Forrester. Father, don't bicker. Asha's showing you respect. Somehow, I doubt it. Would you like to sit down, Lord Whitehill? Aye, and get me something to drink. I'm bloody parched. Talia, how will you fetch the wine for his lordship? Don't fuck this up, Talia. We thought you'd like to sit here, Lord Whitehill. I'll sit there. Thank you very much. In the Lord's chair. It's not like your father wanted your worthless ass in it. It's just a chair. By all means, sit in it if it makes you feel important. What? What did you say? Something not very friendly, father. What are you up to, Forrester? You curtsy like your sister one moment, then act the blowhard the next. Do you even have any idea how thin the ice is here? Calm down, Father. Ash has been amongst sellswords so long, he's forgotten how to behave. Teach him some manners, then. God. <gasps> Whoops. 
Whoopsie. There goes the speaker off the table. Hello, Ryan, mate. So, Lord Forrester. You made your way as a soul sword out there, did you? Hey, a little rape, a little murder. Anything for the right price. Shut up, zip bag. And your family must be oh, that reminds me. And all Professor Zitbeck. The cell sword must enjoy across a narrow sea. Oh, I can't imagine how my sister would be being too obvious. You. I think we're ready for the wine, Talia. Hi! Wine! Enough bloody nattering! Sit the hell down, Griff, and let's drink! And enjoy this massive pig. Toast. We should make a toast. Ah. What shall we toast to? Come on then. Let's hear it. To the alliance between our families, House Forrester and House Whitehill. Let us put the bloodshed behind us. To, to our the alliance. Alliance. families. No, no, no. This isn't right. You first, then me. In the way of the north. Come, Forrester. Let's drink together as lords of our houses. Let me. Let it be you and I who seal this bond. For our houses. For our children. Bye-bye, Mom. Iron from ice. Mother. Not bad. <coughs> water. Bring me water. He's joking. Help him. You. <coughs> you. Yeah. Fucking poison me. Sorry, mother. We weren't gonna do bloodshed. It could have been so different. Quinn, goodbye, Asher. Well, that just happened. Holy shit. We shouldn't have promised to her. We've been betrayed. They killed my father. Attack. Attack. Take down the gate. We can't fight that many. We're doomed. If they breach the gate, we're done for. We can't fight the entire White Hill Army. Uh oh, we fucked up. My lord, your wound. Get them to safety. Of course, my lord. I want to stay with you, Asher. Please, Talia. Oh god, we fucked up so badly. Oh, 
Retake the gate! Retake the gate! Watch out those bastards! Whoops. Um. Whoops. Just, just ignore that happened. Yep. I hit it that time. Just, we're just gonna, we're just gonna gloss over that happening. That's pretty uh Let's see you live up to your reputation. Good armor. Pussy. Whoops. Fuck. Rally to your lord. Oh no. I'm missing all these buttons. Oh, we're so fucked. Oh my god! Come on! Oh my god. This bloodshed, man. his fucking head off. Yes. Badass. Fuck you. Oh, pulling that sword out like a bot. Oh, ow. I felt that.
we have failed ourselves. I can't catch a fucking break right now. Oh no. Damned if I let another lord die on my watch. Thank you. You must survive, Asher. For the house. For all of us. Go! Now! That can't be comfortable with all them wounds. Well, we may have made a few mistakes and picked quite a lot of wrong things to do. Oops. Sorry, Sylvie. It's for the North. For the North Grove, man. What you did was right. I did what I had to do. I'll let you light the pyre. <laughs> where are we, we lighting it? I'm sorry, Sylvie. Your arrival has changed everything. Even though we've been preparing for it all our lives, now we don't have much time. We were sent here for a reason. To protect the North Grove. Winter is coming, and we have a role to play in the war to come. Okay. Our father never would have wanted us to stand by and see how forced or fall. Not while we can still do something about it. It's too late to reach Ironrath. It may already be lost. You know protecting the North Grove is the right thing to do. Those were Gregor's last words. They sent you. You should decide. I will respect Lord Gregor's dying words. The North Grove will never be lost while we breathe. We will defend it. Damn fucking right. He told us we cannot lose the North Grove. In the name of the King, I hereby sentence you to death. Well, shit, Mira. It's all come down to this. Oh. What are you looking at? Eh? You look at me. Which way are we going? I killed one of your guards, bitch. Bring 
Bring forth the next prisoner. What's up, boy? You the you the badass, eh? Hey, yeah, you're gonna watch my head fall. This young woman is accused of murdering a loyal servant of the king. Who here bears witness to her crime? I will speak to them. This woman is a traitor and a murderer. Kill her! She's in a disgrace to her family Kill! name. Mira Forrester. Accused. In the sight of gods and men, and in the name of the king, Endia! I sentence you to die. Raymond! Kill her! If you have final words, Jane! speak them now. She's innocent! Iron from ice! A brave She's woman! Innocent. Oh, noble Kill death! Her! Kneel! Oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Put my beautiful head on this this rock. Be gentle. You be fucking gentle. You know it's fucking wrong, you son of a bitch. Hello, Sarah. Come to see me lose my head. Iron from ice. Is that it? Oh, it's midnight. What's going on? Sylvie, is she helping us now? Or is she fucking off? I think she's fucking off. Yeah, she's fucking off. Or is she? The North Grove safe, boys. They were nothing you and 31% told Lord Forrester you Not wouldn't dead. leave him at the Red Are Red you Red. listening, Beak? Father wanted to make sure they'd bend the knee. You and 42% and what refused. Do I find? A child. You and 6.1 earned With his bulldog something. 30% chose bold Sir Royland. And I thought, whoa. This is going to be fun. Oh, wow. Mira was yeah, so we were completely backwards to everybody else. That day Cersei dragged her before the throne. Grandmother, I was actually worried for her. All 62% told Cersei she didn't what have she any wanted to hear. To Joffrey right in front of me. Then, she had the audacity to go behind my back with Tyrion, when I'd clearly forbade it. And then that letter she forged to Elena Glenmore. As okay. If I find out. Whoops. It was bold, I'll give her that. But oh I can't dear. That she used me. And now, with all that's happened, so we should her, totally play through this. Oh, you 90% murdered again. Ah, yeah, fuck yeah. Grandmother, it makes me question if she was ever loyal to me at all. 30% told Cersei her only. Oh, yeah. I saw something of myself in Garrett Tuttle. I thought I could trust in him. 30% entrusted John. He gave me his word that he'd stay true to the vows he'd made. Sixty-five percent went Yet to the wall. Day was out, Seventy percent broke your vows. At the foot of the wall. 
I needed his sword at Crastus. Oh god, our fucking percentage is a solo. And it cost me. Whatever happened up there, a man of the watch doesn't run away. Who should return then? But another Lord Forrester. Roderick. Back from the twins with balls so shrunken he let Grip White he'll beat him into the mud in his own yard. Reek, I had to come and see this walking tragedy for myself. But he didn't even have the courage to stab me with my own blade. But then, <sighs> he jabbed out that fourth born's eye. He killed the man who betrayed him. Fuck yeah. Fucking, rather starting to fucking like treachery. A shame he didn't last longer. Sacrifice Rod Roderick's life, yep. Savior. See? Who couldn't save Ed. He was, he was fucked. There was something about Asher Forrester. Oh, liked him Daenerys. <laughs> Sexy girl. You and 31% tried to do it. Oh, yeah, fuck yeah. Asher needed my help. 38% told Daenerys you need so an army to I avenge your brother. But I was disappointed. Oh, he Jesus. He seemed a man who cared of nothing more than the moment. But afterward... His uncle told Kept the best. Truth. Yeah. Well, that Asher had been we, protecting she his friend, that. former slave. He had gave up you and 50% chose to save Malcolm instead of Beska in the Dragon's the Cave. In the end. One, he's family, I think. Walks away and Daenerys' camp. Friendship. You and 77% kept them, Sarah's secret. You and 12% told Tarwick about the. Oh, well, shit. In the end. Mira came to understand that grandmother. She could so easily have turned on Sarah to protect herself, but instead, what she did it took grace. If you're fierce enough, you leave King's Landing with your honor intact. Mira proved that, but at so high a cost. Yeah, fuck yeah. See, seventy-five percent of us have got balls. Oh. Roderick dead. His mother dead. His Little pile of timber in oh, ruins. Oh, cool. Whoops. I to see it. That Bolton bastard let their upstart houses go to war, father. Oh, we I'm fucked up. Quite badly. Bastards. Stubborn to the end. They were clever, I'll give them that, but far too sentimental. Ruled by emotion when they should have been smart. Instinctive instead of shrewd. When will these northerners ever learn? The Starks are dead. The war is over. And they lost. Thirty-four percent fought with instinct and nobility. So that's thinking. Thirty-four percent. We fucked up. Thirty-four percent of us have balls. Oh well, that was Oh, okay. It's not a bad game, you. It's the uh, first time I've really done a Telltale series. Not really into this whole select a path shit. Where the fuck are we now? Oh, he did. Actually, where the fuck are we? We don't have much time. Oh. Poor Ryan. Okay, well. I mean, we're up there, look. 75, 66. We're in the majorities of... Uh, except for that one. Sorry, uh, sorry, Mum. Whoops. My bad. I might play this again at some point. 